Dun, 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 dun. Introducing folks, the first official original recorded live here on YouTube, Magello Land X presents. Oh shit, I forgot the title. Uh, produced by R Richard Len Weisgerber. Written and directed by Ricardo Magello and finessed into your present viewing pleasure Reverend Eleven D. Meow! I'd also like to introduce to you folks this morning, I'm having breakfast. <laughs> Out of focus, do your job. This is a Panasonic brand, Lumix, uh, DC-80, oh no, I'm sorry, DC-FZ80, uh, 82 in other parts of the world. This world, I call, Planet Gaia. So, breakfast also entails Zenhard's Breakfast Claw. God, I don't fuck it, you can do it. <clears throat> and more importantly, uh, in view of certain uh, <clears throat> coronavirus generated flus, uh, um, with, uh, anyway, COVID-19, I don't even need to say the dash in that one. I live on this planet in a, on a continent, and it's been divided up by artificial means uh, into these things called uh, countries and states. So anyway, I live in a country called the United States of America, of which I am a proud citizen. Uh, Richard Glenn Weisgerber was born on May 28th in Kirkland, Washington, in that country. So that puts me in Washington. And uh, I moved to Seattle. So I live in the Fry apartment building. It's a Section 8 uh, situation under HUD. Uh, housing and Urban Development, I think that is. It's a branch of the United States government. Anyway, I want to express my extreme appreciation to HUD for my uh, being allowed to uh, participate in this miracle. That somehow uh, my stepfather, Harry Cedric Thomas, who was on the board of directors at HUD, may have been on the team that got this project here. All right, so 250-some units in the Fry apartment building. Uh, address you can look up, and you should see my review I put up on Google Maps about this place. So that was a year or so ago. And uh, anyway, I got this brand new apartment, and I quit smoking and drinking, and got a sweet deal on this piano. It's a Roland brand, uh, model F-140R. It's in contemporary black. Uh, anyway, uh, since I live in King County, which uh, Seattle is located in, which is a part of Washington State, which is part of the United States of America, which is part of the North American continent, which is on planet Gaia. Uh, COVID-19, wear a frickin' mask, all right? Cases have tripled in King County since October. That was a month ago, right? Introducing my uh, performing month chair. Introducing my uh, childhood. I like dinosaurs, and right now, today, we got a whole bunch of dinosaurs that got to go. They're uh, 
burning this place to the ground. So, this piano has a whole bunch of keys on it. A something at the bottom. Yep, we're at full volume 100. And up at the top we have C. 88, key, key number 88. If you start your number line at 1. Anyway, in the MIDI, uh, world of MIDI, uh, A down here is a 0. So we're going to start there. Let's jump all the way up to 88. And if you're thinking hexadecimal, that, that's an alpha numeric thing. So anyway, uh, a whole bunch of professional musicians got together and decided since all these various instruments uh, are all out of tune and it sounds like cacophony, when they try to play uh, music together, they decided upon a concept called Concert A. When's he going to stop? Never. Concert A. I put my fiddle, foot, fiddle on my pedal and whatever, uh, it just goes. That's all I know. It's a sustain pedal. Middle C. start. Oh, fuck. Hey, uh, guess what? Uh, I don't know how to read music and shit, but I'm trying not very hard. And I've got these stickers on Amazon. They're absolutely amazing. It's got the scale, and right here is where the treble clef start, and from there down it's the bass clef and stuff. Anyway, uh, a long time ago, about 1984, I think it was, I said, hey, let's learn how to read sheet music. And uh, I found out about this thing called scales. And I found out in the equal temperament, which is a tuning standard, which there are millions of. And I think people are really to have a lot of fun out there. Uh, but this is the equal temperament, which means from here. So, come today, uh, did some research and I said, what's come today today? Well, it's 442 hertz, not 440, like all, all the freaking music uh, instruments that come out of the factory, as in electronic music of various forms, which I'm quite familiar with and have a lot of work done up on SoundCloud under my Richard Weiser and Ricardo Magello names. You will listen. So I made this page of scales. And then I started at the top and that's A and then D and the C and the D and E and twelve of them somehow. Uh, anyway, twelve scales and I put they were pianos, I like, piano it was a Two octaves of a piano uh, with the keys scrunched, so they were proportionate. Anyway, what I did was I looked at uh, what notes are legal in the scale of A, and then it turns out that's A major. For I got to get a clue on that part, and uh, 
So I went down and I colored in all the legal notes for all the different keys. And then I said, oh, okay, what's next? Oh, the minor scales. All right, so I did the same thing for that. And then I said, okay, let's, uh, how are we going to do this? So I put little dots, little white dots, on uh, the keys that were legal for the, legal for the, uh, playing in the key of A major, and I said, okay, let's do this. Uh, let's just play those notes, and we're good. No matter what we do, we're good. We're in the key of A, right? I mean, isn't how it, how it works? So, uh, I have no freaking clue what I'm doing. Uh, when I look at this little um, uh, what you call it? Oh, shit. I don't even know what that's called. The five lines where the notes go up and down and shit. And uh, so anyway, I got that here trying to absorb it while I'm playing. But starting with A, it's A, B, uh, C sharp or D flat, D, E, F sharp, G sharp, G flat or A flat, um, and then A, right? That's where I put the dots. So this is what came out. made some music uh, while experiencing the uh, miracle of what it does to the human brain. You didn't look it up, you already heard about it, but uh, there's a lot of jokers around who want to make a lies about it. Uh, look it up. So anyways... <laughs> Good. 